What's up? So one thing I wanted to do is just take you guys through more of what my day to day looks like. Um, literally woke up pretty late today. You can see it's like 10, but i um, just going to start knocking out some work and then I'll probably just take you guys through literally the rest of my day. Y'all say hi to Gerald. cool so hit a shower had some breakfast literally just had like two english muffins still looking homeless but gonna go hit the gym and then we will take it from there all right cool so at the gym i'm gonna have to get myself some insulin for those of you that don't know i'm type 1 diabetic which basically means my body just doesn't make any insulin naturally um, so i have to get myself shots or you can get a basically a little pod you can put on your body that will do it for you. But I just do the shots um, for right now. I'm gonna be trying the, it's called an Omni pod. I'm gonna be trying that here soon. But basically, I mean, kind of what I wanted to talk about in this video, and just kind of make this the topic of the video, is really just kind of riffing off of the last year or so of my life. Um, so for those of you that have maybe follow me or you keep up with YouTube you know that I'm building and I do um, online personal training online fitness coaching online for people and that I mean doing that consistently over what the last year and a half at this point has been you know it's been a journey for sure like a lot of people will ask me like oh do you, do you like it or, um, you know, what is it like, all these things. And it's kind of difficult to give an answer on that because they're just like in life in general, there's so many different avenues, one that you can take, like you can choose to do so many different things with um, the skill set you already have. And you can, of course, you know, advance your skill set and basically add new things uh, into what you can do, but really the biggest thing I feel like is just kind of having the staying power to stay there and do that thing consistently day in, day out, week after week, and it's not, I don't mean for this to be some like motivational grind, you know, kind of talk because I think a lot of that stuff is honestly pretty worn out and just kind of cringy. But, you know, a lot of people, like I said, will ask me, like, oh, what is it like? Or, like, should I do something similar? And I think when you have to ask yourself those questions of, like, what should I do to make money, to, you know, maybe you want to build a business, like, it really does take you just going after something and dedicating yourself to it. And you're only really going to actually get dedicated with stuff as a guy if you put money into it so there's basically two ways I look at it it's either you put money into it or um, your reputation is like directly tied to your success so like people publicly know like if you fail at this thing you, you know in the back of your head people are going to see you as less um, so you couldn't come through on the promise list so I feel like those are the only two ways that guys actually change are investing money and then there's something tied to your reputation with it like whether you can come through like on your promises so when people ask me and maybe you're watching this video trying to figure out like what should I do all this stuff like I don't even necessarily have an entire complete picture of you know what I'm doing obviously I love um, fitness I love building that stuff out I do like creating content as well. I want to do basically more of the video, just talking to the camera like this. But 
yeah, that's a, that's a huge thing for sure. Is you do have to just figure it out as you go. Um, a, a good way to think about this is like build the plane while you're flying, basically, because by the time you build the perfect plane on the ground and you haven't even taken off, people are going to be asking for a helicopter. People are going to be asking for a spaceship. So just start the thing that you want to do. Literally just start. It's not going to be comfortable. It's going to be a little bit maybe even weird at first. You're going to have people doubt you. That's that's just part of the equation. Like Stop trying to work past that or get past that by waiting and thinking there's going to be a perfect time because there's really not. You know, even me, like, sitting down to make this video, initially, like, okay, do I want to get, do I want to do this? Do I want to get on camera? Like, I don't even really enjoy it that much, um, to be real with you. Now, I do like the benefits of creating stuff because I'm actually very creative. So I like to go in and I like to, okay, take what I've filmed, edit that, chop it up, and, you know, throw a little artistic, um, like, switch or kind of, like, um, twist to it, you know, to put my own spin on things, but it's not necessarily that, like, I love, just absolutely love creating content, I like the, the other, like, benefits of that, of, like, okay, I get to put this out, and hopefully someone actually benefits from this, you know, maybe I can make a connection with somebody where, you know, we can start working together, or whatever it may be, that's really the real reason behind putting out content, and, this last like year, year and a half, I've been I've been doing nothing but putting out content like Instagram. Um, I'm not really on TikTok as much right now, but like Instagram, you know, YouTube, like just putting out content constantly. And I haven't even really been that active on YouTube, but just basically, you know, putting a reel out every single day or at least minimum, you know, three to four days. Right now, I'm doing one a day. Um, that's basically part of a challenge, but that's like a huge thing to think about is no matter what you do, you know, you may want to get into entrepreneurship. You may want to get into just kind of like doing your own thing, thinking that, Oh, it's going to equal like a ton of freedom and a ton of like, just, Oh, I don't have to do anything, but it really doesn't work like that. Like that's just a lie, especially sold to you by people. If you want to have an impact on a high level and not only benefit from it yourself, but like actually feel fulfilled with the work that you do, delivering results to people no matter, you know, what you do for work or business. Like it is going to take basically that component of, okay, sometimes you're going to have, you know, really late days. You're going to have early mornings. Like for example, <laughs> I woke up later today. So like tonight there's a good chance that I'll just be working later. My schedule is kind of dependent on a multitude of things, but that's really the biggest thing I guess I just wanted to share is if you're thinking that you have to have every single thing figured out before you start or before you embark on some type of journey, some type of investment, you know, some type of move, whatever it may be, those things that maybe aren't the most like financially secure or like the safest option or even in the eyes of other people like your parents, your friends, other family members, you know, they're going to tell you what to do based off of their own experiences and what's going to keep you the safest because they do care about you at the end of the day. But I mean, it's 2023, like you can basically get a job anywhere. Like right now, just imagine you got fired from your job you have right now. You can basically get a job anywhere. You know, I would hope if you're you know, just somewhat creative, you can, you know, spin up a business, you know, relatively quickly, um, and even if you feel like you can't do that, like I said, you can always work for other people, you can always, you know, provide value in some way, in, in one form or another, there's something that you have that will provide value to someone else, and people are willing to exchange their time, their money, um, even their, like, opinion in terms of endorsing you. For that stuff so just something to keep in mind kind of just me talking about my last year year and a half of just kind of heavy entrepreneurship um, I don't even like calling it entrepreneurship but just like kind of building my own stuff 
dude, there's tons of ups and downs. Like, it's not like these, like, the days are the same ever. You know, you have really good days, you have really shitty days. Um, sometimes you have really hot streaks where everything's flowing very nicely. Sometimes you have cold streaks. And you do have to just keep in mind that when you're doing these things and you're pursuing these these avenues and these goals, these paths that you basically want to go down and chase is, you know, you do have to reach a point where you start to leverage and kind of take out your weaknesses from the components. So like I'm very ADD, ADHD. So like right now we're working on bringing in an assistant that basically handles all the organization stuff that I suck at and that I don't really like to do. So that's a huge thing once you once you reach that that point with your entrepreneurship stuff. Um, you know, start building a team, start building a culture, and start having standards, and just do that from the from the jump. Like, if you get your fitness in line and you start um, getting discipline, um, just with like your routine, you don't have to be on you know David Goggins type stuff. But as long as you're disciplined with your routine and you really start building something that aligns with your vision and your goals for the future of the world that you want to see and create around you, um, it's inevitable that you'll be successful with it. So just keep that in mind.
All right, so it's actually like two days later now. Um, I suck at like editing and honestly getting some content out um, at times. So this is gonna be the uh, end of this video for now. Um, literally this morning, just wrapped up at the gym, had some breakfast, and then gonna get started on some stuff with work and taking care of some clients. But um, really just, you guys let me know down below, is this style of, you know, videos, putting stuff out there, um, something that you like, just let me know, comment below. Um, Cause hopefully, you know, I do wanna do more of these, just show you guys a little bit more insight on my day to day and just kind of like daily process um, stuff. So if that's something you wanna see, let me know down below. And then other than that, I will see you guys next time. Bye.